Hello YouTube and welcome back to UK Highland Photography. Today we are going to be talking about the fuzzy select tool which we can see here in the toolbox. Now the fuzzy select tool it is basically a tool that you use in order to select shades of colour. For example if we have a look here you can see that I've highlighted a section of this petal. Now if I click here I've also highlighted a section of the petal and here I've highlighted a section of the petal. Now the reason why I'm only highlighting sections is because of the threshold, the threshold down here. As you can see it's currently set to 15.5 so if I select here it will select 15.5 of that shade of colour. Now if I press shift and then click somewhere else like here you will see that it's now added another 15.5 of this shade of colour and if I go here press shift left click again it is now added 15.5 of the threshold of that shade of colour if I wanted to select this entire range of light brown colours, which I do, and if I use this method of the shift and left click, then basically I'm going to be here all day. So instead what I'm going to do is I'm going to increase the threshold to say 115.9 and now when I click on this petal you will see that I have now highlighted, quite frankly, most, if not all, of the light brown colours. And that is exactly what I wanted to achieve. So I'm going to make a new layer here, because what I want to do is I want these petals here to match the red petals at the top. So now I've made a new layer, I am simply going to get red colour then I'm going to get my brush here and I am going to increase that and now I'm going to start to colour in these petals as you can see it doesn't look very realistic now at, the, now at the minute at this minute in time but I can assure you it will look something like a match in a few seconds so here we go now we've got it so what I'm going to do is I'm going to adjust my opacity so the bottom layer can come through to give it more texture and as you can see that now looks a little bit more like the top petals so there you go guys you've just had an introduction to the fuzzy select tool here on GIMP. Remember to subscribe to the channel and when you get the time check out our online shop over at www.ukhighland.com